We're tracking aircraft on our cell phone, this time on Broken Signal. For hardware, you'll need an Android phone, OTG cable, and an SDR USB dongle and antenna. I have put links in the description for the OTG cable. Make sure you pick the right one for your phone. Also, they do make USB SDR dongles, especially for ADS-B, or you could use a standard one. I have had success with many antennas, but with all things radio, an antenna tuned for the frequency will give you better results. So first we'll go to the Play Store. We will search for SDR driver. The first link SDR driver by Martin. We'll click that and then click install. This will install the driver for our SDR. Click open and we'll see the driver has been installed successfully. We'll close that and then we'll install the Avair ADSB software. So if we go to the Play Store and search for Avair ADSB, and then the first link is ADSB Receiver, we'll click on that and then click Install. Once it's done, we can click Open. We'll click OK to the disclaimer. And we'll see it says no supported USB dongle found. So we'll go ahead and close everything. And then we'll plug our USB dongle into the phone. It'll pop up the RTL SDR driver. We'll check the use by default for this USB device and click OK. Then we'll find the Avair ADSB app and open it and it'll pop up again allow the app of air to access the USB device we'll click use by default for this USB device and click OK now we'll see it says listening for frames be patient verifying communication and under the ES frames we can see it's starting to load frames if we click on traffic we can see that it's already found a plane, but we're still waiting for it to fill in more information on the plane. Once we have more data, we'll hit the back button and then we'll click the map button to view the planes on the map. Different classes of planes will show up differently on the map and helicopters will show up like helicopters. And now we're tracking planes on our cell phone. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button, and if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button. And as always, thank you for watching.